just taking a stance that they want to be in the forefront and be the leaders in change and how we're putting power into the grid. You're putting new equipment in there to be able to sustain another longevity of 50 or 60 plus years without having to replace anything and going forward. There are advances in technology that have been done that are providing new tools for us to be able to look inside a functioning, working piece of equipment that you can't necessarily take offline every day to, to check to make sure it's okay. You know, we now, from our digital controls, see information that wasn't ever available to us when it was a more of a kind of a mechanical device. The intelligent devices are capable of collecting real-time system information and providing it to other systems. The old network didn't have the capability to pass that information along. Before, the system operators could only react to, to events as they occurred. Now, with the intelligent devices sending information in, they can react preemptively. That's going to allow you know, improvements in you know, reliability and reduction in cost because you're not maintaining something that doesn't need to be maintained and you're potentially preventing a failure that could have resulted in, in a bigger problem. NIPA wants to be really the industry's you know, leading driver in innovation. They're saying it, but they're actually doing it. You know, we are executing and we're moving forward.